Hi, thanks for watching RTC on Channel 4. I'm Alec Garrick here with Brant Edgison, and this is this week's sports report. All right, we'll start off with last Wednesday. The girls' soccer team was defeated by Culver Community with a final score of 4-2. to two. Shaley Kelly and Mariah Yoakum scored the two goals for the ladies' ease. And the next sporting event was on Friday. The football team traveled to Wabash to take on the Apaches. The Zebras shut them out with a score of 27 to zero. Both Jacob Hattershell and Carter Screeton had over 100 yards rushing in that game. And on defense, Matt Basham was a monster with 15 tackles. Five of them were sacks and three were for a loss of yards. And Brent will tell you about Saturday. Saturday was a pretty busy day for RHS fall sports. The cross-country team traveled to Manchester for the Manchester Invitational, and the girls finished fifth of 16 teams, and the boys finished sixth of 12 teams. Sarah Birch finished 11th overall in the girls' race, and Tyler Byerline finished 11th of all individuals in the boys' race. Both the girls' and boys' soccer team also traveled to Manchester for the Soccer Manchester Invitational. The Lady Z's won the championship game against Whitco 1-0, and Chloe Richard was named the Manchester Invitational MVP. The boys lost to Manchester in the championship game 2-1, and Noah Roberts scored the lone zebra goal. The volleyball team improved their perfect record to 9-0, beating both Bremen and Culver Girls Academy on Saturday at Rochester. The boys' tennis team finished third at the Bremen Invitational. They lost to Bremen 2-3, they lost to North Judson 2-3, and they beat South Bend Washington 3-2. Sounds like a pretty busy day on Saturday. And then on Monday, the boys' tennis team fell 4-1 to one to Triton at Triton. And Marcus Smiley was the only victor in that match at three singles for RHS. That rounds up this week in sports at RHS. I'm Al Garrick here with Brad Anderson. Thank you for watching RTC on Channel 4.